Hello golfers, this is Bob Laskin with 2minutegolf.com and my partner Vinny Brasha and today we're talking about Tiger's wedge play at his own tournament and we're talking about grain and bounce. So what we can learn from this is that when Tiger hit this shot, the grain is growing this way and so that's typically towards the setting sun and so when we see this come down that leading edge is hitting into the ground before the ball and so see where it catches it now we're going to talk about that grain and so when the grass this is Bermuda grass growing this way towards the setting sun and so that grass is growing there lays there all night then if you have to chip this way your club is going to get caught in that if you're using the leading edge and so when you're using the leading edge your shaft is more forward than the amount of bounce you have so I mean this is like 30 degrees forward and there's five degrees bounce so it's just the leading edge is getting snagged on that grass now if we go the other way it slides right on over it so down grain using the leading edge not so bad into the grain you better hit the ball first so can we use that wedge into the grain so this is the same grain growing this way and so we have hitting behind it but here's the difference five degrees bounce that shaft is kind of back so we're hitting the bottom of the club back here not the leading edge is not digging and so that club slides through and so that's that's ideal if that shaft comes back to perpendicular and you've got enough bounce you can hit that shot now if you're into the grain and it's like tiger shot put a hybrid hit your putter play the ball one more ball forward with your putter get it on top that's the percentage play now tiger one of the best wedge players of all time and you know come april the masters if he has that shot again he's going to hit a hundred out of a hundred but it's kind of good to see him you know like the rest of us mortals you know hit that shot because he hasn't been practicing and kind of changes his swing a little bit but it's a good learning experience for us to understand grain bounce when to use it why we should use it and so let's look at this one more time so that's using the bounce properly so the leading edge is not digging see because that's five degrees bounce and that's hitting the bottom of the club the back of the bounce is sliding through no digging pure shot okay now here's the bad one Vinny was nice enough to chunk one for us and here it is so this is five degrees bounce shaft is forward and so you can see here five degrees bounce this shafts forward you know 23 degrees leading edge there that leading edge is digging it's hitting that all that grain can't get through almost double hitting that that's not great so we want this we want we want this to slide underneath make sure the shafts more straight up and down we're using the bounce slide it through that's how you use the bounce into the grain now if you're hitting that shot it's going to be higher and softer and so if you want to hit the ball first if your shaft's going to be forward you know that's okay too but you just want to make sure if you're going to hit this shot you understand the risk involved